ladies what's going on this is your girl miss queen minded and i am coming at you today with another word something to help you just be a better you so today what i want to talk to you about because i'm actually in the process of doing this is turning up <laughs> i like to drink you know just like everybody else but i don't you know sip but i'm at home you know this is my house um chilling you know with my with my man and I always thought like it is definitely a way to get turned up you know we all like to drink we like to do our thing but it's ways to do our thing and it's ways to get our body on you know what I'm saying so that's what I want to let you guys know my idea you know if this works for you it'll be great so this is the first thing the first thing that you got to know when you're going out to the club is what is your kryptonite like we all got a, a kryptonite no liquor is the same it's the one liquor that you drink every time you just ham it ham it ham it stay away from that it's either brown or the white one of the two that's number one you got to know which liquor agree with you and which liquor don't or you ain't got no business out there drinking to begin with so once you determine what your kryptonite is that's when you eliminate it out your drink if you're going out you don't do that you don't do your kryptonite ever that's like you don't fuck with brown you don't put it, you put that down. Whatever caused you to get too drunk, you don't drink that. Okay, but I'm the type of, I like to drink multiple drinks. Okay, if you like to drink multiple drinks, this is what you do. You get you a shot of whatever kind of liquor you like. And you sip on the shot and you chase it with a beer. That's about it. That's, and you just do that maybe like one round of that. Get your favorite liquor, whatever it is. Whatever kind of liquor, but just a straight shot. And like I say, ladies, we sip. We don't chill. You don't take the shot. You sip on the shot. You just a little adult, just a little alcohol to your system. And you gonna get tipsy. You gonna get tipsy like that. You know what I'm saying? A woman, it is not a uh, God number one for the woman to be drunken. We're not even we're not even supposed to be drunken to begin with. But if you is gonna drink, if you are gonna drink, you gotta do it with the moderation. You gotta do it with the thought. And it, because the Bible says that it it first of all. You don't want to be out here vulnerable to these men and get played, be fighting all in your emotions. So if you're going to be out here in this world, you know, which you really need to be turning up at home, which is really the safest place to drink at home, whatever you need, not in these streets, right? So hold on one minute. Let me check my, my biscuits because I'm in here cooking too. All right. So if you're going to... um. I'm in the middle of making dinner. Sorry about that. But if you're going to be uh, out here in these streets drinking, don't be trying to get drunk, drunk, drunk. Get tipsy. Little one little shot that you can do two. You can handle two shots and two beers. That should have you right. You drink that there. You sipping. You talking. You dance. You can dance with those little two shots in your hands. You ain't got to do all that. But my point is, don't be out here getting drunk excessively hurting yourself skinning up your knee elbows this here that acting a fool see because if you get a felony you can't even get a job at burger king so definitely don't want to do that one shot of whatever you can handle stay away from your kryptonite and chase it with a beer make sure you drink some water because you will have a headache get you a gatorade to take home so you can wake up and drink that in the morning gatorade power whatever your choice but you need to replenish yourself you know what i'm saying oh it is not a god to be drunk at I'm going to bring you some Bible verses that say the same thing, but I figured, you know, we, we sisters, so you're going to trust what I'm telling you because I wouldn't tell you nothing wrong. But you don't want to be out here on World Star half naked fighting and, and all this. It's ridiculous. Ladies, we got to step our game up. A glass of wine, maybe a shot of liquor with a glass of wine. If your stomach can't handle it, do that. But calm it down. It is not other woman. You look so horrible. There's nothing, less, there's nothing attractive about a drunken woman. Period. You can thank you, cute, but everybody that's looking at you like, damn, she is really fucked up. <laughs> it's really fucking sad. So listen, I'm not gonna tell you to do something I don't do. I'm at home. I don't really go out to the clubs because there's nothing out there. You know, my whole thing is I like to be home. I'm a homebody. Some of you may not. Y'all like to go out and eat, whatever, whatever you do. You know what I'm saying? But it's a way to do everything. And if you really want to get your life together, you really about representing. You know who you are and bigging yourself up as a woman and, and, and at least trying to get right with God. You got to 
you got to make steps because that's the ultimate thing for any woman is to really be, be to be able to be called a godly woman these days is a joke. So you got to put it out there. And the only way that you can begin to even correct that is giving yourself discipline. You got to learn to take care and discipline you. But I'm about to run out of a little data to sell um, space on my car. So I got to get off and I got to erase some of these videos. I got to hear for you guys and upload them. I love you. Queen from creation at gmail.com. You are friendly, friendly life coach. I created a new group and we're all about really getting to know who God is and really about our purpose. Your friendly, your sister, uh, life coach, spiritual life coach group. But um, hit me up <laughs> and I'll give you the information. If you want more information, queen for creation at gmail.com. That is like to my phone. I get it. Love you guys. Keep watching. Subscribe. Peace.